And new at four, the head of investigations for Caldwell Police Department was under investigation and today Lieutenant Joseph Joey Hoadley was in court for the first time where he entered pleas on two federal felony counts he faces. This comes as the FBI investigates current and former Caldwell police officers for what sources call misconduct, mostly in the street crimes unit. Seven investigates Morgan Romero was in court for Hoadley's arraignment this afternoon. So Morgan, how did he plead? Yeah, Lieutenant Joey Hoadley pleaded not guilty to those two federal felony counts and his attorney Chuck Peterson asked for a jury trial. We've been reporting on this for the last couple of weeks now. You may remember a grand jury indicted Hoadley on federal civil rights charges for using excessive force during an arrest back in 2017. This came as part of that FBI investigation into Caldwell police officers. The high ranking law enforcement official is charged with deprivation of rights under color of the law as well as destruction, alteration or falsification of records in federal investigations. A grand jury indictment alleges Hoadley used unreasonable force when he hit a man while he was trying to arrest him, leading to bodily injury. Charging documents allege Hoadley falsified records to cover up misconduct. The indictment says Hoadley falsely said the man was trying to escape and didn't mention he hit the man. If convicted, Hoadley faces a maximum of 30 years in prison for these two charges, as well as more than $500,000 in fines. The government didn't ask for Hoadley to be detained before trial, so right now he's on unsupervised release. The court set Hoadley's jury trial for June 21st at 9 a.m. in Boise. Judge Scott Scavdahl, chief district judge for Wyoming, so he's coming from out of state, will oversee this case moving forward after the hearing when I asked on what grounds he could plead not guilty. Uh, his attorney said because he's not guilty. Simple as that. Meanwhile, we do know that Hoadley has been on paid administrative leave with Caldwell Police since January. We asked for several weeks whether he was or not. Mm -hmm. They confirmed that to us last week. So are there any other steps now between here and when that trial date has been set? Uh, not necessarily, you know. They could change that trial date, they can move it up, they can move it back, mm -hmm. uh, but they were prepared to do so today. They set that date, they set that time in court today. That hearing, that arraignment was roughly about 15 minutes, so pretty short. Pretty quick hearing. Yeah. Okay, Morgan, thank you. Yeah, you bet. All right.